Yes. 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 We are playing Warlock Control. Mono Black Warlock Control. <laughs> That's right. In Historic Brawl. One of those uh, Commander-ish formats. Yeah, yeah. Let's get straight into deck tech. Why not? Mm. With Warlock Control, Mono Black. We played Mono Black before in this Commander-ish series. It's been a while, though. We played it with Corvec, the Spiteful. So, a lot of fun, right? You're trying to destroy all their tokens or whatnot. And we have other minus, minus abilities, right? I mean, we cut down on this particular build because Corvac is not the commander. But we are going up with more control style things and destroying their hands with Thossies and Inquisition. So, the Warlock of the Hour, the Hag the hourglass coven so it's a six drop four generic two black for a three three legendary warlock hag <laughs> enters the battlefield you draft a card from its spell book twice then you put those cards into the battlefield that's some crazy value that's two free cards right and they're all warlocks in this uh spell book each one does a sp particular ability Usually to deal with more warlocks. I mean, it just gives you more bodies on the battlefield. And I'm not going to talk too much about the deck list. You know, it's just... Uh, it's It swings between hand disruption and board control. And I think there's a couple combos in here. I think. <laughs> Let's get some gameplay. This hand seems a little slow. I think, I think our deck is probably a little slow. We have the merchant. So if we draw a land here, it could be pretty good. We have Devotion in hand. Moldrotha. Alright. That's a value machine. One's already off to a fast start. I mean, our go blank seems pretty decent. So let's hope we just play one thing next turn. I don't particularly like this card in my opening hand. More elves. So, okay, he's gonna double spell? No double spells. Interesting. So, we get the biggest thing from their hand. Hopefully, they don't. Um... Oh no, that's not that card. Oh yeah, okay. So we memory lapse it, that's that's okay. He doesn't know about the go blank. One oh, still has counter magic up. Uh yeah. So I conjure those. Oh, do we conjure it to each other? Euro. That's an interesting one. That's really great because now we have go blank. So go blank is going to be an amazing card. But he, does he have the, well, he doesn't have the mana for it. No, this costs, oh okay, yeah, it costs one blue. And he played the blue. This might just destroy him. Nice, let's go. So I conjure all those to my hand. I'm correct. I get my own card back. Nice. Yeah. That's pretty good for our opponent. 
Let's destroy some of their one drops here. Or we can Maelstrom post their, their commander. Because now he's going to be bring things back. I do I want to do so many things that my deck is not letting me right now. Alright, so let's let's get up our mana and then get rid of his commander. And no taxi. Okay. Ooh, he's falling right into the, the spiteful here. Oh, yeah, let's give it to him. Oh, he's he's out of luck now, right? Your rock? Hey, that's something. This comes into the battlefield tapped. Which is kind of sucky. I mean, we can do this and play the the Nyx. We want the mana. We've been lagging behind this whole game. Not today. Ornithopter hits us. We gain one life. <laughs> Do you even care about this guy? Um, permanent entering the battlefield trigger again. We kind of don't care too much. That's why you're getting a life. Or two. Alright, so this taps for four mana. We have four devotion. This would significantly increase our devotion. So we could do this and then play the, the coven. Do we want to do that? Maybe you just want to play the, the Coven and then? Yeah. Yeah, let's Coven. Sacrifice. Uh, Warlocks have Ward. That seems pretty good. Yeah, Warlocks have Ward. And now we could uh, Gary for 8. What else? We could still do things? Like, oh, we have mana. We have mana, boys. Oh, we just killed our thing. <laughs> Alright, attack you for four. Opponent is the witchy deck? I don't think so. I really don't think so. Okay, that's a 1-1. One, one. Moldrotha costs uh, a lot. 5, 8. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Mono black control. <laughs> now just picture me with like a long bubbly nose and messier hair. I mean, my hair is pretty messy right now, but no one needs to know that. Oh no, yeah, this is the one I'm familiar with. I'm just about if you look at the top six. You review angel, demon, or dragon. Put them to your hand. Oh no, wait. This is not, this is not the one. There's one that puts them into the battlefield. Now that's dangerous. Point foretells. Okay, we actually have a creature turn two. We actually have a very nice curve here, and the pony gives it up. No controlling happened here. Just couldn't face the the warlocks, the witchiness here. <laughs> pony goes first. We have Lily. Seems pretty decent hand. We have three lands. We have a combo piece. Oh look, one of our two warlocks in the back. This one actually got buffed with a recent alchemy update. 
I think it only had like one of those things. Whenever you gain life this turn. Whenever you we're, you lose life this turn. During your turn. Oh, is everything is during your turn. Oh, sweet. We drew into our curve. Stomper. Well, that does nothing until much later in the game. I think we're just going to start discarding the opponent's hand. Or we could go more aggro. I mean, drawing cards is always pretty good. The thing is that this thing lives, and um, and if they get to, they play another weak creature, it's probably worse for us. Nah. We're getting alive. We're drawing cards. For answers. Nice. We can still be on curve here. So this is during our upkeep. That's interesting. <coughs> so we gained whenever you gain oh we could have played this beforehand. We suck sometimes don't we? Um well that just happened. Alright. We're killing this thing. When I win, you're telling me. <laughs> Haven't you ever heard of personal space? One has six. Got shifting on a hasty. Getting rid of the lily. That seems decent. A delay. Nothing more. Yep, that was your job, Lily. Good job. Um, four. You could go Warlock. Warlock into Warlock? Seems like a plan. Seven mana. Group of parts are vampire. All right, they're doing some things. <coughs> Chittering auger. Um. All right, let's play the land. Do you, do we just play the the coven here? What are they after here, you know? <clears throat> I think they're gonna block the glint, so we stop drawing cards. This is already at four power. I think we hold this back, even though it does provide a lot of value. I like the idea of doing this and then putting Gary into the field. Can we make them discard more cards? Go with that. Maybe we don't attack? Oh, he's drawing cards with that. Maybe I should have gotten him to discard more cards. That's, this is at seven. Oh, he's doing that for five. It's 
So we can't pay life if we can't sacrifice things. Alright, they have a land to discard. We're amassing things though. Four, five, six, seven, eight. We finally have enough for his dude. Right, I think we're gonna play Gary next turn. I don't think we attack though, you know? <clears throat> Use three to a creature. I don't even know what he's trying to do with that. But let's, I think we draw a card. Blank. Hmm. So this is at 11. He's, he would kill a couple of my creatures here. It would be really bad if he just wipes the board, but... No attack. Yeah, here comes the combo. Gain some life, I presume. Untaps always lands. I didn't read this. All right, so yeah, that's definitely a target right there. <laughs> yeah, that sucks because that was three pips, three black pips right there. Okay, more blockers. Maybe we should have attacked for some to block. Yeah. That's very good. Um, some life yeah that makes sense you could also get rid of something um either the ceratops or the, the sharn or we could just play scavenging like this yeah he doesn't want this card no more all right but he's at six Gary will kill him from here and he doesn't block anything else He's trying to get rid of now. Um, I do a damage to a player, reveal that many cards, put any number of them of dinosaur cards to the battlefield. Well, that's trample, so we're not gonna block. No, he whiffs. Okay, okay. That's pretty good. Um, kill you? Kill you when we attack? Let's go! Gary! I mean, Warlock Control. Not too bad. I mean, we didn't wipe his board or anything. 
I mean, is there a black board wipe like that? We can't play the domain one. I don't think there's damnation. I haven't I haven't really checked. <laughs> but uh, the mining thing does seem pretty versatile. It's on it's on flavor, you know, with the warlocks. All right, we got removal. We got searchability. All right, we got removal like crazy though. Just because of this guy we're keeping. I mean, this looks like control deck. <laughs> We might not have any uses for these. Mm, okay. There is a creature, after all. Well, that lined up perfectly. Mm, that's... That's okay. Um, all right, Pona's going for the long game here. Curses? Pona's really gearing up for the long game here. Ugin, Ugin's pretty nice, but opponent has no lands. He's stuck at three. Let's get rid of the, the board wipe here and start going aggro. Lift a form, that's fine. So we could double spell here. Yeah, let's go for it. So we could just look for a combo and just be done with it. Shatter. Definitely this guy. <laughs> kidding me <laughs> that's why shatter's not that amazing you know but um we have it in our deck it did work for us that's all i gotta say I hope you guys are keeping up with uh, the YouTube channel. We have been posting this week. Um, last night I, I posted up the second part of last Janky Thursday's video, which is the the Post Malone concert. I hope you guys enjoy that. And uh, not today, tomorrow. Yeah, yeah. I guess I'll post Janky Thursday's video on YouTube tomorrow kind of short on lands here we do have a turn to play it's not amazing though um, yeah I kind of I way rather prefer this there's a lot more flexibility we get to discard their hand but do we, we have the choice of either going more land heavy or praying to the magic gods that we draw more. One has a control that going on. That's tiny bones. Hopefully we don't remove it. So I think we're definitely gonna go with uh, the Palkia's predation. So, sorry hags, we're gonna have to wait for the old high row after all. I 
Okay, so he does have red mana. He's trying a Chromatic Lantern. That seems pretty good. You could bedevil our thing. Yeah, you could. This thing at the beginning of your end step, exit the top card of your library. Until your end of your next turn, you may play that card. Whenever you play a card from exile, create a treasure. This will ramp him. This will ramp him. We actually have an answer for this, so let's get this. Hey, he's definitely gonna kill it now. <laughs> We're getting value, almost not, yeah. Sounds about right. All right, so we could go blank him. It's gonna be pretty tough on him, but he's not, he's not gonna really play anything. I mean, sure, he'll, he'll play something, but we'll get rid of it. Right, he gets some sort of value. Let's try this out. So he has his little artifacts, dread presence. Minus four, minus four this. Swing away. Oh, he can't play this yet. He, he doesn't have any green. <laughs> he could kill our... our Priest here. Yeah. So he has five, five mana. We only have three. I think we just killed the direct presence. Thing's gonna bite us if we don't kill the red present, but it's gonna kill us if he if he holds this in hand. Like if he plays that, I think it's kinda over. Let's play the creature here. I mean if he plays a swamp and plays this. Well he can't he can't actually do that, can he? Guy eternal bond to Second, one land. Looking for the forest here. Hmm. Are we okay with him blocking our thing? I mean, we're, we're not okay in this spot at all. Like, where's our card advantage? We have none. I don't know why we have this. Maybe because of Lily? Okay. I'm okay with that, actually. This thing is just rotting in its hand. I really don't want to just throw this out there. But yeah, why not? That's an edict effect? Breaks in arena. Swamp. Okay, that, that was a bad play, like, 
Wow, what a draw with our lineup of a play demonic pack. So he's gonna draw more cards or what? Deals 420 and he target game four and then he loses the game. Oh but he could sack it. I don't particularly like that at all. Um I think we gotta get rid of this thing now. Does he leave it in the graveyard or does he put it on top? Puts it on top. All right, so we have we have a combo pieces. Oh no! Oh no! Um, we sacrifice conjure. This is not good. That's not looking good, you guys. Assassin's Trophy, okay. That gets rid of our combo piece. Let's look for a basic. Berksian Swamp, sure. Oh, so it like negates the ability. That's not cool at all. So he has Bantu now. So we need to keep on drawing removal cards. <laughs> That's not removal. So he could literally sack everything and then this thing gets a billion a billion. I don't know what we're gonna do from that. Menace. Draining seems pretty good. Scry 2. I think we're gonna have to scry 2 to be honest. It's a wrap. Bones agrees as well. Liliana? I guess it's not game. No more distractions. Let's make this one of your friends has to leave. He attacks us. Serpent. Serpent doesn't do anything for us. Okay. 
we go out our own way. Forget you, opponent. Saying good game before it's over. I mean, yeah, that's a very strong deck, though. It actually benefited him not to play his commander till the late game. Hmm. Noted. Um, wow, this card is really amazing versus those colors. I think we're keeping this. Should we turn one serpent? Just to have something. run this out. I'd rather they ca uh, counter this than Underworld Dreams. Wow, they're still holding up mana, huh? You can fatal push the cat, bring it back. Play this as a land. Maybe they're out of counter magic. Maybe. fine with him blocking either or. Alright, we're gonna play this. Nice. Resolves. I like that. This opponent can't go off. Unless they bounce this thing. By your side, I am always there. Citadel. I think it's pretty nice. Um, his interest tapped. I mean, they can't kill this thing. Do we just go for life total here? So he's going for life total too. <laughs> tool. Use it. He counters it. It's a pretty good counter spell. Can he still play it though if uh, what something died this turn?
All right, so it dies. We go kill Galazeth. Kill Galazeth. And play Deadly Dispute. Or play this. Okay, so we could still play this. Right? I think this is pretty fair. He's going for light totals as well. Which Bola Citadel doesn't seem that amazing. Oh, we had this. We could have saved up mana at five. We were too short from this. That's good, because this is a good blocker. For the realm. Yeah, we're blocking here. Here to the abyss. Too much mana costs. Not enough actions. Oh, he's killing us? There's a number of cards in your hand. That's five. And he's hurting himself too. Just put a build five and then maybe make him draw cards. Oh, wait, that made him draw cards. All right, not enough mana that game. But it happens. You know, I'm not gonna win all games. This is for fun. This is not. What is it? Commanderish CDH? Like what? C. What is it? CHB? Competitive Historic Brawl? I think we're keeping this. We have. We have removal. We have. Extra lands here. I'm not sure if we play this or not. We might draw into more lands. But usually that's the case, so let's play the land. I have a pretty nice curve here. I would like that turn one. Uh, I think we just play this right now. To be fair. Alright, so opponent has some card draws. Alright, some blinking effects. Faceless agent. Did we just get faceless agent? Where's the land? Ballsy. It's 
Sweet. I think we want him to discard more cards. A mind is a terrific thing to waste. Wow. Alright, so everybody discards a card. I wonder how this card lands if that was them. You really need those? <laughs> okay, I'm done. Beautiful. I think we I think we discard lands. So I needed to draw a card there. That's completely my fault. Lily, I, I, actually, I would have kept Lily. <laughs> I would have kept Lily no matter what. Portable hole on the bank buster. All right. Got us with that one. I'm swinging. So we could bring back a creature. We have none. Draws a card, discards a card. You didn't let me activate anything. So we could go next turn Coven. Those who get in my way tend to regret it. Sacrifices must be made. Oh, that comes into play untapped. So I guess we didn't need to do that.
drop it. Witches are here. They're gonna need a board wipe. Pawn did a huge mistake by discarding lands. I mean, he recovered them. Took a while though. Okay, so he seals away. What? Oh, all right. So they discard their mind flare. They sack something or lose three life. They lose three life. We just give it a Lily right now. He's gonna blink everything. He has no other option. I'm done here. Oh, that's my <laughs> off you go. Boom score off the top. <laughs> oh look at that. We drew our lucky land to replay the coven. So much value. Um Ward. Double ward? Sure. So target removal can't get rid of them. It's gonna have to top deck another board wipe. Vanishing light. That's a uh, ability. <laughs> yeah, if I would have done just one, I mean, he still would have been there, but. Witches! Alright, so far we're seeing some nifty plays. Beating out Yurion. Beating out the Dinos. The only deck we've lost to is, um... Is it? Yeah, yeah, they actually out-tempoed us. Yeah, we didn't get to control them good enough. Oh, super sweet. He has Judith and Obosh. Obosh has the companion. Um, yeah, we have Tiny Bones, we have Go Blank, Warlock class. And he's trying a pretty aggro here. Go to our Warlock class. Yeah, this is an aggro deck. <laughs> we need our our sweepers. Mm, I can't see myself blocking anything here. You go, Judith. No blocks. Trespasser? I actually really like that. I think we just go go blank right now, though. We have a healthy life total right now. We're gonna pass the turn after this. Okay. Nice safety net right there. Judith, sure. Do we block now? I think we, I think it's safe to block now. We have nothing else to discard. Maybe just get rid of the ginger brew.
I like the lands. Um, go for Trespasser here. Or Kaisel. Kaisel. Could probably Kaisel next turn. Dumps it to Soul Shatter. Soul Shatter seems pretty good, actually. Let's see what they do. I'm gonna limit their damage significantly. We're at 11, though. Thief. It's either freebooter now or never do it, I think. I think next turn they're gonna be drawing cards. Uh, do we want to take three more life here? Uh, I don't think we want to take three more life. Actually, I think we just do this now. Do we hit anything? No, we don't hit anything. If we if he draws a land, we're screwed. to remove this we're fine with that I think we're screwed Keep up removal. Let's see what happens here. There she is. Discard a card and we die. <sighs> oh man. Was that the right play? We have the witches. Let's pray to some god that. That these witches believe in, that we could possibly win. Each one of those first cards exiles the graveyard. Do that. Scry? What's scry? So he can still play... Oh, he has that. I didn't even see that. <laughs> oh, man. That was a very tight one. We we were supposed to, like, gain some life with that Shadow Spear. Very thin margins, but... Uh, yeah, that's a deck. Ooh, 
this is gonna be very rough, right? Morwin. Morwin seems really good. We'll try this out. I like the war warlock class. Combo enabler. Turn one play. Draws us cards. Ooh, that draws us cards as well. Uh, might as well do this one. Or what? No, we don't know what we're looking for exactly, so let's just draw some cards. Palkia's Predation. Do we have anything, any play here? We don't, because this comes into play tapped. These both come into play tapped. So opponent's just going off with elves. But he has no ramping. That's good at least. This combos with this. We're, we'll be putting two lands in the graveyard in the process. And this needs a lot of mana to get off. It's five, six, seven. The same with this, though. Let's get a land. the shambling um so we have four total mana all right let's go with the scavenger and the guest next turn we could prank and make them kill both creatures it looks like Four total mana with Nixus. I was not born in Sky Shroud, but I protect it as my home. I'm increasing you more win. Making more mana. Going off. <laughs> hmm. So he's not going to sacrifice Morrowind. We just do all ability abilities here. Um, discard a card, draw a card, sacrifice a creature. Let's discard that. Nice. So let's minus minus this. I'm gonna play that. So we took out both lords. 
That seems pretty good. Now, what do we do this following turn? We could up our mana to play Villis the following turn. We could just sack some spiders. Harmony with nature is our greatest strength. Only has a lot of mana he's playing with. He's gonna give it to the warlock class. I mean, that's fine. Yeah, like I said, this is going to be a very rough match. He's drawing cards already. He has the mana. I'm going to play that opposite. Um, wait, why is everything getting buffed, though? Oh, this... Okay, that makes sense. We have to kill Morrowind. We don't have the answer to that. Three, four, five. We could really go off next turn if we play this. It seems pretty bad to be skipping a turn here. Well, let's do it anyways. <laughs> this is probably our only, only choice here. Right? Draw cards until we hit removal. We blossom with nature's magic. Destructibility that works. So what you're attacking is it sleep or what? Ah caramba. He just created an elf for every single elf he has. And that should be game. Wow. Oh, I didn't even notice that. Yeah. GG, that's a very powerful deck. Well, great. That's enough time of some... Whoa. Commander... Commanderish Brawl? Commanderish format? Historic Brawl is the format that's Commanderish. Because it's like Commander. Ish. That's enough time I have for today, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to like, follow me and all the social medias. We're on TikTok, Instagram, YouTube, and on Facebook doing lives. Like we have photography and Instagram. We have shorts on TikTok. Everything's on YouTube. So go check it out. Let me know if you like it. Start a conversation with me while I'm live on Facebook. I really much appreciate it. And yeah, till next time. Till then, stay hydrated, yo.